Project Zomboid is a difficult game, and if you're just starting out, odds are you went through the tutorial. It'll show you the basics of the game along with a surprise at the end. But did you know there used to be something else there instead? Till Death Us Do Part. This was a story of Bob and Kate Smith and was also the tutorial before the current one. Bob Smith is a middle-aged man who we control in this scenario. Kate is his wife who is lying injured in the bed. Her leg was broken due to an earlier encounter with looters. First, you are tasked with treating Kate's injuries and getting her some painkillers from the bathroom. Next, you have to barricade the lower floor with supplies you find in the backyard shed. And after that, you head back upstairs and rest for the night. When morning comes, you go outside and gather food. You go to the neighbor's house, find a zombie, kill it, scavenge for food, and find cans of soup and other pieces of food. You return home to find a can opener and cooking pot to make a pot of soup. As you place it in the oven, Kate calls you upstairs to listen to a radio transmission. Make sure you turn off the oven. After the transmission, an armed NPC enters your house, and depending on some factors, this interaction can go in different ways. If he sees you, he'll have a short interaction with you, have you lead him upstairs, and shoot Kate. If he doesn't see you, he'll wander the house for a bit, head upstairs, and shoot Kate. If you attempt to attack him after he sees you, He'll shoot you and most likely kill you. So if you want to save Kate, your only chance is to hide from him and ambush him with the hammer. After that interaction, the tutorial ends and you're free to survive in that world for as long as you can. That was the story of Bob and Kate Smith. It was taken out in 2013 along with NPCs to be revamped later. There was a trailer earlier this year showing the new models of our protagonist and I'm very excited to see what's in store for them.